And first at five, we've all heard about the mental health challenges so many students are facing. And now a major grant will go towards helping students in the Wausau School District overcome those. News 9's Adriana Daniel is joining us live in the studio. She has a look at the impact it will have. Melissa, you can do a lot with $300,000. That money is on its way to the Wausau School District over the next three years, helping the school tackle two of the most important issues impacting the lives of their students, their families, and their teachers, homelessness and mental health. It takes a village to raise a child. And this week, three donors funding a resource that will protect students in the Wausau community. We were shocked um, in terms of the number of children or youth under 18. Um, I, about 34 percent of high school students in Wisconsin report feeling sad or hopeless. 18 percent report having feelings of suicide. The Wausau School District will be able to open a full-time staff position for a homelessness mental health navigator. This position will be working with social workers and counselors to bring direct services to students. One main focus is assisting students and families experiencing homelessness. These grants will help ensure the student gets to stay at their school of origin and work with high schoolers on creating a strong academic career plan for after graduation. And on the mental health side of the grant, it will be supporting the needs of students and providing families with counseling and services also offering community events to bring education and awareness. We'll remind our families and our students that mental health support is needed, that it's acceptable, and it's not just a school district issue, that we all need to work together because our students today are going to be our citizens tomorrow. And now that there is kind of this, this starter money and this, this grant going, um, there is a direct venue for other organizations to make the same kind of donation. So it doesn't need to stop here. This is really just the beginning. The district does have several possible plans in place to continue this position after the grants run out in three years, continuing the work of the homeless and mental health navigator for years to come. In studio, I'm Adriana Daniel, News 9 WAOW.